what advice you would give to someone considering coming mm -hmm. to UCI mm -hmm. for a doctoral program? Mm -hmm. uh, what, uh, what do we have to offer here that's uh, maybe different than mm -hmm. in other settings? Mm -hmm. well, um, well, so doctoral students may look at different things and they should look at um, multiple things. Of course, a lot of people tend to look at financial support. That is important. I think actually what UCI offers is fabulous. Very, very few students actually provide financial support that UCI does. Yeah, we uh, guarantee five years of funding absolutely. for all the students that come into the program. I find that actually personally amazing. <laughs> when I went to a um, you know, doc program, we didn't have that. We maybe had like a partial support, maybe to one student out of the entire cohort of say 40, right? So what you see I, at School of Education is doing for the entire core, cohort and then guaranteeing it for five is I think it's just amazing opportunities uh, for students and they should not be taken for <laughs> granted. Uh, and I think that's really it shows the commitment of the school right, to training these students and future scholars or you know, people in various fields um, who go into various fields. Um, the other piece, I think, uh, is related to what drew me um, to UCI, which is really renowned uh, faculty members, right? So, you know, you, as a doc student, you spend a lot of time with the faculty members, and that's who you learn from. And therefore, you know, having strong scholars in each field with experiences and expertise, and that's key and critical. So um, I think we have really experts in so many different aspects and doc students should really carefully look at their work, right? So whether it matches their interest and also the way faculty members approach a particular research question and do they have opportunities to, you know, um, like uh, for them to have a practical training in participating in research project to see the process of getting research done, how they think about and approach a question. Um, so all those pieces are important and I think UCI does have that, you know. Uh, we have you know, truly fabulous faculty here and I think that's really one of the um, Keys. So one of the things that I make sure to t share with um, potential or prospective doc students is really for them to think about the commitment it takes for them and for the faculty and for the school. So for the student, it, they're committing their at least five years, for example, a lot of times, right, of their time and effort. And it's huge commitment, and it's going to have a large influence on their career trajectories afterwards, right? So they have to think about that carefully. It also is a commitment for, uh, for faculty <laughs> members as well. We are spending a lot of time with them. Uh, we're actually uh, investing resources in them, right? So we have to, you have to think about that as well. And of course, schools are providing, uh, you know, investing tremendous amount of resources in them, right? So think about all these things uh, from a multiple, I guess, of perspectives, and then and think about the training that they will get, right? So it has to, from all different angles, we want, you know, everything work the best for the students, right? So I want the students to think about those multiple aspects, not just one thing, okay, maybe this is the time to apply, <laughs> but without thinking about why and what it implies for their future. I think one of the things that I was impressed about UCI after having come to UCI is the care that faculty members put into the PhD program. I was really um, uh, very happily surprised about it. You know, the conversations that go on in the f committee meetings, and uh, they re we really put a lot of um, thoughts into the curriculum and the how to provide support system for the students. And then another piece that I kind of found that's different, at least compared to when I was in the top program, is support system. Like uh, there, we have student support systems, mm -hmm. you know, for you know student organizations and things like that. Uh, that I wished that I had. <laughs> and you see, high school of education does have that, and I think that that's. Um, 
you know, something maybe uh, so for students who are here, it's it's what they experience for the first time that they think that that's maybe um, the case uh, in all the schools. That's not the case in all the schools. Yeah. I think that the School of Education here has the um, it provides really a very good support for students. Right. We're not just connected to the community, mm -hmm. but we are a community. Exactly. Yeah, uh, exactly. Here as well. Yeah. Well, if you. Thank you.